Chafes, brethren, yo, little babies, we're going to be watching ReZero, season two, episode 20. And there's no title for this. But last week's or last episode we watched in regards to Subaru, he talked with Dio. Guys, what's his name again? Oh, it's going to bug me. Otto? No. Roswell, you fucks. Thank you. Roswell. He talked with Roswell, and I'm assuming we're going to get a little more backstory with what's going on with him, because at the end of the day, everyone's so secretive. Chafes, if you guys are enjoying the ReZero stuff, we're closing in on the end of the series. Please be sure to leave a like on this video. I would really appreciate it. If you want to see the uncut version of this episode, I post all my uncut reactions to Patreon. No filters, no edits, no none of that. So if you want to go check that out, please go check it out. Subscribe if you guys are new, because I'm watching one of your favorite animes as it stands now. You know, something you've seen in the past or you're watching currently. I'm probably watching it. So make sure to subscribe and come over to Twitch if you want to see the, un not the uncut, but the live reaction of whatever I'm watching, such as ReZero every s Friday because I skipped Saturday. Wait, shut up. Anyways, let's get started. I butchered the hell out of the intro like usual. Yeah. The man's gasping for air. You good, bro? Was constipated. That sucks. A grave illness. Oh, you horny, Roswell? You horny for the girl? My man's over here having a heart attack, and this fool gets bricked up for no reason. <laughs> yeah. Huh? Hey, yo, mods. Bro. I'm over here just always alone and shit with my cat. Like, <sighs> he just yacked like hard. Like, it wasn't even like, it wasn't even like, you know, he yacked like out of his mouth. Like, it's probably in his nose too. You know, that shit was gross. Gross. Do you feel a bit better, bro? I would. It's called the magic release period. Oh, no. What's up, Elmo? I mean, he has every right to be like, you know, he's probably overjoyed with the fact that he's been living with this condition for a pretty long time. And then some random pretty girl just starts macking on him after a nice little throw up, throw up action. And now he feels better. Wonder how else she can get. Here's a present for you. <laughs> I wonder how else she can get that man out of him. I wonder. Shulok, with the twenty months, I appreciate it truly. What's up, fella? How you doing, man? Interesting. Bro, he's so like, what the? Dude, he looks so happy. I wonder why. I, I wonder why he starts putting so much makeup on. I still remember every word she said that day. Oh. It's like a big old happy family. What's up, Andrew? If I haven't met her that day, I'd still be suffering alone now. Met her that day, or she ran up behind you and intruded into your space? Because there's a difference. I don't like that lukewarm look in your eyes. That's fucked up. <laughs> Teacher. Have you been getting along with... Wait, teacher? Wait, what? You be macking your teacher, bro? The fuck? Unless? That day the sanctuary was born. Oh, yeah, we were going to learn the truth about the sanctuary. That's what we ended off last week's episode with. This girl talks more than I thought. Holy shit. The fuck? Imagine opening a door, 
right? And then there's just same doors leading, across, you know what I'm saying? Like, hell no. I'd be fucking losing it. It's more than a joke. You're some lucky guy who is blessed with talent. Oh? <laughs> Beatrice ever bothers you again? Just come to me. Basically, just come snitch. <laughs> oh, God. Reading makes your life richer. <laughs> why didn't you come to Ryuzu Ryuzu's teacher? What? Oh, why don't you become her? Oh, wow, it's smoking. Okay, some some family. This is basically just family talk, then, right? No wonder Luke is poor. What? He is here. Who? Oh. Huh? The plans of the sanctuary are in place to an extent. The sanctuary was just one step away from completion. The one who meets the requirements to be the core of Ach Achida's barrier is me. What's the point of the of the of the sanctuary i need to know that much human and demon human blood here on a scale large enough to activate the barrier you were the last push needed to complete it bro i'm trying to figure out what's going on like what is the point of this barrier why do they need to throw it up who's walking down the aisle outside in the forest what's happening we'll use your od as the catalyst to make the sanctuary work Having Beatrice prepare the location where the core will be placed. I stopped watching this show years ago. I don't even know what the fuck is going on. Wow, bro. I started watching this show not too long ago, and I still don't know what the fuck is going on. Fun fact. The ReZero universe and Tokyo Avengers universe are connected. That's why you both, they're both mid. <laughs> See, now, now that I laughed at that, I'm going to get, you know, someone in the comments and be like, I you don't like it. I just, I laughed at a joke, bro. You should put that in the title. <laughs> the whole thing. Oh, Roswell getting a ship tossed? Let me see your face. What? All right. Unrecognizable, by the way. Damn! This is the worst of the worst of the worst. What? Who the fuck are you? Oos. Oh, this fool's dead. Roswell's dead. Oh, a fireball? Nice. Melancholy? But why? Like, why is he here? God damn! Your pupil fought bravely to keep him here and buy you time. What is this? Wait, hold on. This fool talks exactly like Roswell. Ah, I, I heard that. Are they gonna fuse or some shit or what's up? You were so adorable back then. Unless...
So the core, like, she's going to be crystallized, right? Like, that's, if I remember correctly, too. Like, that's what happens. Like, she becomes crystallized. She becomes the core, no? Oh, yeah. She definitely gets in that fucking crystal. Don't just stand there staring mindlessly at it. You and the peoples living here are truly blessed. You can repay that by working your hardest, I suppose. Bro, what the fuck is going on? Apparently, according to cut content, content, it says that we didn't see the fight with Echida and Hector was because no one could understand how great a battle it was. Uh-huh. Allison needs to save Roswell before he ends up dead. This facility has been prepared to place a barrier over the forest. I was to spend time activating the barrier as its core. That's why Roswell has sacrificed so much. Because he knows he can't save. Oh, really? Oh, she just realized what's going down. It's it's cool seeing Beatrice like showing that uh showing like she cares and shit, you know. Everyone can just run away from here through the my door close crossing. True. I mean, it's not a bad idea. So all of this. So basically, it's kind of like Noah's Ark in a sense. Like all of this was just so they can. They and they said it themselves. They brought a bunch of like mixed be, uh, beast blood people here. I, I just. But why did they need to do that? Are mixed beast blood people or whatever in constant danger outside? If uh, gonna be you know or what? So they can stay in peace in one place to contain Hector. Is it to contain Hector? The beast people are just ingredients. This is fucked up then. So why, why, I guess my question stems from like, why do they need the beat? Like, did the beast people come here on their own accord? And stay at the, was at the beginning? Living here made me happy. Boom. Shit is going down outside. I need to see when this barrier gets activated. What happened? Hector has been chasing Achina and they wanted to stop and stop him here. Got it. See, when, when the fuck was I supposed to figure that out? I promise to teach you how to read and write. Damn. My eyes. I think that story is true. What of it? Exactly. Thank you, Roswell. What What of it? You know? What happens now? I didn't come through these 400 years only to bend to a change of this degree. I'm quite surprised at how quickly you changed your time. Oops, I mean, he's, he, yeah, he just said all that truth right there. Oh, no, you shouldn't have said that. I didn't just decide to follow my boss because he beat me in a fight. Face the past for the first time in 10 years. Okay. I will tell you that the one big reason I decided to follow him instead of you. Is rather than the one who told me to stay weak forever, why wouldn't I follow the one who says I need you because you're strong? All right. Uh, 
Your greatest weapon was bound. Oh, yeah. It looks like he has the same eye, or one of the same eye as uh, Hector. Because it's what you've believed for so long. And they're just fucking yelling at each other. For 400 years, I have loved only one woman. Fucking simp. <laughs> Subaru can bring him to her, no? For both you and me, so long as the one crucial person remains. Damn, Roswell, you talking shit about Millie like that for no reason? It's inevitable that she will be scorned as a witch. Ooh, scrap him by the neck. Oh, he's grabbing real tight for someone who they can kill him easily. I'd be watching my shit out. Oh, I thought he was going to punch him. He did the exact opposite of what he wanted him to do. He's going to come to sever that last desire of yours. In the sense that we are both force our ideals upon the woman we love. <laughs> She still has her second part of the trial, no? She's good now. I mean, she did a good job. She beat her first part, which is tight. Ram! <laughs> okay, so the reason why I paused right there, right, and the reason why I needed, I was about to say something. My question, you know, the anime adds questions to my variables, so I need to ask them. What was the point of that convo? between Subaru and Roswell, as in, what's Roswell's goal? I'm just, that's what I'm so confused about. Why does he want Amelia to fail so badly, even though they were so close before in season one, you know? Give up on what? I, I'm just so fucking utterly confused about Ro what the fuck does Roswell want, you know? I don't know why they said devil, but the Hector is a warlock. Blah, 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 blah. So to speak, he is the only male witch. And I think that way Roswell speaks and dresses the way he reminded himself of his shameful loss against Hector. I also saw people saying it was not mistranslation. People agreed that they would get warlock, but devil is not a, an accurate translation. Well, I didn't even, I don't even, you know, I didn't even notice that. To get Roswell to give up the attack on the mansion. Okay. Now, once again, just so we can recap, why does Roswell want to attack the mansion? Can we get a reminder of that? Because, like I said, like, this is kind of just really fucking confusing on why he wants to, what is his goal? Remember, Roswell wants to Subaru to follow his uh, book? Okay. Got it. Because fuck that mansion. It's just, it's just so, like, confusing. And, you know, watching it once a week, it does get a little bit more, which means Subaru only can choose Amelia. The way I see it, he's doing what the gospel says. Gotcha. And this gospel ranges from the witch's cult. And I'm assuming the witch's cult has something to do with the Chinda, or whatever her name is. I don't know, never finished the show. Thank you for your very wise input. You can't save everybody. Okay. Gotcha. Well, Amelia seems like she's doing okay. We're going to see how everything pans out. This one was a little bit more dialogue-inducing. They were just yelling at each other for most of the time and spewing each other's ideals at one another. At the end of the day, beans, what the fuck? That's usually what I usually end my sentences with when I don't want to talk no more. Sugar, you know? Because Roswell wants Subaru to be Amelia's crutch and do the trials for her. 
Gotcha. But then Subaru's trying to be daddy. Gotcha. So Subaru can choose a million and let Rem die. What? All right, fellas. We're going to keep continuing with the show. If you guys enjoyed this episode, and if you guys want to answer any of my questions in the comment section, please go ahead and do so. My confusion should not hurt you. My confusion should not irritate you. This show is very confusing. It's probably one of the most confusing animes I've ever seen in my life. It is. I'm going to keep it a stack, and I've seen a lot. Subscribe if you guys are new. Leave a like on this video. Come watch it next time live on Twitch so you guys can watch it live and yell at me about things I'm not understanding. And if you want to see the uncut version of it, just so you... Just so you know, I didn't miss anything that they what they said. You know, make sure to check out the Patreon. Shout out to all my Patreons. I appreciate you guys. With that being said, I hope you guys have a wonderful, fantastic rest of your day. Another day, another anime. This is your bro and mother. Peace out, y'all. Unless, bro, this is a self-report. You saw her tie her up, right? It's on video. Bro, you call the cops, and she's just okay with it? Like, no shots? Is this going a little too far? Nah, man. I've seen this before. I think this isn't Saw. Why would she marry someone like you? Swindler. Bro, what?